What up you guys? I'm back with a, another video. If you don't know who I am, I am Nando. Welcome to another video. As you can tell by the title, yes, this is a tie-dye t-shirt haul. And I'm gonna explain to y'all how many tie-dyes I have. I'm not gonna try them on, I'm just gonna show you because that would take too long. But before we even get into this video, what I need y'all to do is hit that subscribe button, like this video, and hit that bell to be notified when I upload new videos. Other than that, always remember, be you, do you, stay you, no matter what, you are the only one that can manifest your dreams and your good desires, bring them to life. But other than that, we're about to get into this video. So, these are all the shirts that I'm about to show y'all. There are 12 tie-dye shirts that I got half of them literally from walmart i kid you not from walmart literally walmart and maybe um target and another one from like a discount store so we're gonna start with the first one. Oh, and from spencer's so this one is from spencer's this first one this bob marley one is from spencer's i like the way how it looks so i got it so this was my first one this was like my first ever like tie-dye shirt of me starting out. So this was it. Then, handmade one. This one I made myself with the mushroom right here. I call this one the mushroom tie-dye shirt. Boom. And I kind of ripped it too at the bottom. So that was legit. This is my second favorite one actually. So I'm going to go in order on how they... Uh, which one is my first and second this one I also got in in Spencer's too this one right here look the piece and the color in the back this one I got in uh, Spencer's actually with the Bob Marley one that day I remember this I got in Walmart <laughs> this one I definitely got in Walmart I remember it Yep, this is when I went to Walmart in New Jersey and I seen this and I was like, you know what? I gotta get me this one right here. I fell in love with it. The colors were brighter, but I literally like washed it all. I washed, like not washed it all. I washed it too many times, so the colors started to fade. And this one, I also got in a Walmart, but I rarely wear this one. I don't know why. I think it's because it was a small. Uh, let me see. It was actually, this one is actually a medium. But I washed it, I wore it once, and after I washed it, it kind of shrink. So I'm gonna have to like stretch it out again. It fits, it's just a little tight. But yeah, I got the color caps. Now, I also got this one for one more. This one, let me show you. This one, I. This one I got from, oh, this one is from, also from Spencer's. Have a nice trip. Pretty dope. This is my favorite. I wear this one in the summertime with some like shorts when I want to be comfortable. My favorite. So I'm going to try to find me ones this color again when summertime comes around. This one I got in Forever 21 right here. This one I love. I actually cut this one up. As you can see. I cut it up. I made it look de-stressed. Then. I also got this one. From Forever 21. De-stressed it. In the back. See. I like the patterns. I really try to make one like this. But for some reason. It didn't come out that way. So I was like. You know what. I'm going to look in some more tie-dyes and designs so hopefully I could get them this one I literally got from like a drift store like it was they, not like a drift store it was like a discount store and they had like tie-dyes and I fell in love with this one so I was like I gotta get this one I wore this one for 4th of July actually because it has like the 4th of July colors but yeah it made me look like a popsicle <laughs> <laughs> that day this one I got this one from oh 
This one I actually got from Walmart with the mushrooms and stuff. Just pretty nice. It's pre it's old. Like this one is real old. I had this one for like maybe like pfft, what a few years right now. So this one I made myself. Um, I try to make the the cannabis plant, but it didn't work out. But <laughs> the colors wasn't supposed to even be like this, y'all. The colors was supposed to be brighter. It's supposed to be like that bright, like have a nice strip on. The colors were like that, and then it just ended up just turning these colors. You see, but it's nice though. I I like I really liked it. Like after it dried up, when it was wet, the colors were like popping out. But then when it dried, it looked nice. Then this is my last. And, no, this is not my last one. I'm gonna show you my last one. This one I also got from a discount store. This one was dope. It was bright, like real bright. That's why I bought it. But after I washed it, the color just faded. I'm just realizing now that when I get tie that shirt, I'm definitely not going to dry them. I'm gonna actually wash them and hang them. So that's what I'm gonna have to do. And my last and final one, which I have it on right now, which is the Alice in Wonderland tie dye which is like bluish purple and greenish so yeah this is my i think it's like 13 point but other than that <laughs> i just want to thank you guys for watching the video if you enjoyed it leave a comment down below where you think i should get more tie-dye shirts from um and i'll try them i'll buy them i'll actually do a actually tie-dye uh t-shirt haul like putting them on and stuff but other than that, give this video a thumbs up. Always remember, be you, be you, stay you. No matter what, you're the one to make your dreams come true and manifest them. And I'll see you on another video. Peace.